Hello and welcome to PrepTel. In this video, we're going to show how to use the Resumeter Resume Optimization Service. To get started, log into Resumeter. Here on the Manage Jobs page, we choose Add a Job. To begin, Resumeter needs a resume and the target job. Just fill in the information for both. For the job, just cut and paste the job information. Submit this information. After Resumeter processes the information, you are provided with a summary analysis. This analysis shows three important sections. Missing information, potentially incorrect information, and missing keywords. Choose Continue after reviewing the analysis. Now you are in the main editing screen. The resume is on the right side of the screen here and the suggested improvements are on the left, here. You will notice in the resume some information is highlighted in red and surrounded by brackets. This identifies information that is missing. Not all missing information needs to be added to your resume. For instance, this shows cell phone missing. I don't want to include my cell phone number so I can skip this information. You don't need to remove this bracketed information because it's there for display only. Next, you will see words in yellow. These are keywords that are critical to your resume, but only contain a part of the entire keyword phrase. The green words are keywords that match and don't require any changes. On the left, you will see missing keywords. These keywords were not identified in the resume and should be added. We recommend you cut and paste these words into your work experience and provide additional language so it reads properly in your resume. For instance, I will copy Efficacy Data DDR. I paste it here and add some text in front of it to make it read well. Do the same for the possible keywords. Look for the matching phrase in your resume. We show you the matching words after the hyphen, here. Now that you have updated the resume, choose Save. The resume will be processed again and you can review your summary analysis by clicking here. If you are satisfied with your rating, download your resume here. Your resume will be downloaded as a text file. We recommend you use a text file whenever submitting your resume online. Text files have the fewest errors, thus ensuring your resume will be processed correctly. You may be hesitant to use a text file as you want to keep your fancy formatting in case someone views your original resume. Remember, your resume will be viewed in the applicant tracking system and not in its original format. When you get the interview, this is the time to have your fancy resume ready to hand to interviewers. If you have a different resume you want to use for this job, you can upload it here. And to get back to the Manage Jobs page, choose this link. On the left side of the screen, you can update information regarding this job. The most important information to update is your status, here. The status indicates where you are in the hiring process. Resumeter uses this information to update you on what you should do next. If you get an interview, Resumeter is going to alert you to your interview guide. Let's look into this in the next video, PrepTel's interview guide. This concludes this video. Thank you for using PrepTel.